Next question comes from Bondi Beach Beer. Paul, here you go, buddy. Hey, Adzi, you big old baby maker. <laughs> what percentage of troop loss do you expect for A, lagers, no dry hop, B, hoppy pails, and C, New England IPAs? Uh, I, I talked around to some different folks. You know, I, I have uh, I have the kind of the lost numbers for what I look with, for what I work with, and and for what some of my friends are doing, what some of my friends are seeing out there. What I'm seeing is typically I see about 10% loss on lagers, about 15% for pale ales, and about 30% for New England's. Um, you know, obviously the variables here are uh, hot volumes what you're able to get out of your kettle in the first place into the FV, the amount that you're sucking up in your FV with dry hop and whatnot. So, yeah, but I think that's a, that's a pretty good, good rule of thumb. Uh, if you know, the more hops, you know, if you're doing eight pounds per barrel for your new England style IPA, then, uh, then, you know, you're going to have more loss, but, um, my buddy who's doing new England style IPA and he's probably doing a four pound, Per barrel dry hop that's my guess um he's probably using some advanced uh hot product in the kettle to reduce green matter um to reduce loss um but yeah so uh that's that's, that's some pretty solid uh rules of thumb for that man and again thank you so much for your super chat brother i appreciate it all right, everybody, thank you so much for watching. If you feel as if you got any value out of the video, please like and subscribe. There are also other videos that you can watch. They're gonna maybe be over here or over here. Appreciate you watching.